हेलो स्टूडेंट्स इन प्रीवियस वीडियोस वी लर्न अबाउट ट्रिग्नोमेट्रिक रेशोज ट्रिग्नोमेट्रिक रिलेशंस एंड वैल्यूज ऑफ ट्रिग्नोमेट्रिक रेशोज फॉर सम स्पेसिफिक एंगल्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न ट्रिग्नोमेट्रिक आइडेंटिटीज सो वी नो दैट वॉट इज मीन बाय आइडेंटिटीज ओके सो आइडेंटिटीज इज अ इक्वेशन विच इज सेटिस्फाइड फॉर ऑल वैल्यूज ऑफ एक्स और all values of variable we know that identity is suppose if i am taking x square minus y square is equal to x plus y into x minus y so this is an identity so it is a equation which is satisfied for all values of x and y okay so that equation becomes an identity so here trigonometric identities means in that equation trigonometric ratios are there and which is satisfied for all all values of theta okay or which is satisfied for all values of angle okay that is acute angle okay or here it is acute angle but it is satisfied for all angles okay that is acute obtuse okay but for 10 standard we have only acute angles okay so now we are going to prove that trigonometric identities okay so first identity is prove that sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 okay now we have to prove this identity okay for all values of theta okay so first we have to take case case first that is if theta is equal to 0 degree okay so if theta is equal to 0 degree we know that sin 0 degree is 0 and value of cos 0 degree that is a 1 okay so if we put this values sin square 0 degree plus cos square 0 degree is equal to now sin square 0 degree means 0 sin 0 bracket square sin square theta means sin theta bracket square okay so sin square 0 degree that is sin 0 bracket square plus cos square 0 degree that is a cos 0 degree bracket square okay now sin 0 degree that is a 0 plus cos 0 degree this is a 1 1 square is a 1 so 0 plus 1 is 1 so for 0 degree this identity is satisfied that is a sin square 0 degree plus cos square 0 degree is a 1 or sin square theta plus cos square theta is a 1 for 0 degree it is satisfied now case second if theta is equal to 90 degree now if theta is 90 degree sin 90 degree sin 90 degree that value is a 1 and cos 90 degree this value is a 0 okay so sin square 90 degree plus cos square 90 degree is equal to so this is sin 90 degree bracket square plus cos 90 degree bracket square so sin 90 degree is 1 so 1 square is 1 plus cos 90 degree is 0 okay so 1 plus 0 is 1 okay so this identity is satisfied for theta is equal to 90 degree also okay now third case that is we have to consider theta is an acute angle okay case third theta is an acute angle okay so suppose triangle or oh sorry angle xay this is angle theta and which is an acute angle okay draw 
पी एम टेक पॉइंट पी ऑन ए वाई ड्रॉ पी एम पर पेंडिकुलर ऑन एक्स ए और ए एक्स ओके नाउ इन ट्राइंगल पी एम ए नाउ इन ट्राइंगल पी एम ए एंगल पी एम ए इज नाइंटी डिग्री एंड दिस एंगल पी ए एम इज अ थीटा ओके सो एंगल पी एम ए इज इक्वल टू नाइंटी डिग्री एंड एंगल पी ए एम इज इक्वल टू थीटा ओके सो दिस इज अ राइट ट्राइंगल सो हियर वी आर यूजिंग पाइथागोरस थेरम सो देर फोर बाय पाइथागोरस थेरम वॉट वी हैव पी एम स्क्वेर प्लस ए एम स्क्वेर इज इक्वल टू ए पी स्क्वेर ओके सो दिस वी हैव सो दिस इज इक्वेशन वन नाउ वी हैव टू फाइंड द वैल्यूज ऑफ साइन थीटा सो साइन थीटा इज इक्वल टू सो वॉट इज वैल्यू ऑफ साइन थीटा हियर अपोजिट साइड अपॉन हाइपोटेनियस सो पी एम डिवाइडेड बाय पी ए और ए पी देन कॉस थीटा इज इक्वल टू एडजेसन साइड अपॉन हाइपोटेनियस सो ए एम डिवाइडेड बाय ए पी और पी ए ओके सो नाउ वी हैव टू टेक साइन स्क्वेर थीटा प्लस कॉस स्क्वेर थीटा वी हैव टू शो दैट दिस वैल्यू इज इक्वल टू वन सो साइन स्क्वेर थीटा प्लस कॉस स्क्वेर थीटा इज इक्वल टू साइन स्क्वेर थीटा दैट इज अ पी एम स्क्वेर अपॉन पी ए स्क्वेर बिकॉज वैल्यू ऑफ साइन थीटा इज अ पी एम बाय पी ए सो साइन स्क्वेर थीटा इज देर मीन्स स्क्वेर ऑफ दिस सो पी एम स्क्वेर बाय पी ए स्क्वेर प्लस कॉस स्क्वेर थीटा कॉस थीटा वैल्यू इज ए एम बाय पी ए सो ए एम स्क्वेर बाय पी ए स्क्वेर ओके now denominator is same so we can add numerator so pm square plus am square upon pa square so pm square plus am square this value is ap square or pa square so pa square divided by pa square so this value is 1 okay and here from 1 we get this pm square plus am square is equal to pa square so for acute angle theta sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 so in three cases if theta is 0 degree if theta is 90 degree and if theta is an acute angle in all the three cases we got that sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 okay so this is first trigonometric identity okay and this identity is satisfied for all values of theta okay therefore it is called as identity okay but here in 10th standard you have only for acute angles okay but it is satisfied for all angles of theta that is obtuse angle right angle okay so this is a first identity now we will prove second identity that is a 1 plus tan square theta is equal to sec square theta okay so second theorem is prove that so theorem 2 that is a prove that 1 plus tan square theta is equal to sec square theta okay so again we have to consider same diagram that is a x a y this is angle theta okay take point p on a y draw perpendicular p m okay and in triangle now we have to prove this in triangle pm a angle pma is equal to 90 degree okay therefore by pythagoras theorem we have 
by Pythagoras theorem what we have p a square is equal to p m square plus a m square okay now we want here 1 plus tan square theta so what is the value of tan theta that is a p m by a m so if we divide each equation or each term by a m square so we will get here 1 plus tan square theta okay so divide each term by a m square okay now p a square by a m square is equal to p m square by a m square plus a m square by a m square okay now this we can write p a by a m bracket square then this we can write p m by a m bracket square and plus a m square by a m square is a 1 okay so here p a by a m so p a by a m so if we consider for refer reference of theta p a by a m that is a sec theta okay because definition of sec is hypotenuse by adjacent so this is a sec theta bracket square p m by a m that is a for reference of theta it is a tan theta so tan theta bracket square plus 1 so this identity we can write sec theta bracket square means sec square theta tan square theta plus 1 okay or this if we rearrange this that is a 1 plus tan square theta is equal to sec square theta so this is a second identity okay so first identity is a sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 second identity is a 1 plus tan square theta is equal to sec square theta okay now we will take third identity okay that is a prove that 1 plus cot square theta is equal to cosec square theta okay so here i am keeping this diagram as it is theorem 3 prove that 1 plus cot square theta is equal to cosec square theta okay so this is third one so here we have to prove this one again same we have to prove this in triangle PA, PMA angle PMA is equal to 90 degree so by Pythagoras theorem P A square is equal to P M square by A M square okay now here we want cot square theta so for reference of theta what is definition of cot that is a A M by P M okay so if we divide here <coughs> by P M square so divide each term by p m square okay so p a square by p m square is equal to p m square by p m square plus a m square by p m square okay now this we can write p a by p m bracket square p m square by p m square this is one and this we can write a m by p m bracket square okay now p a by p m so p a by p m that is a cosec theta okay hypotenuse divided by opposite side that is a cosec theta bracket square is equal to 1 plus a m by p m a m by p m that is a cot theta so cot theta bracket square so we have identity is cosec square theta is equal to 1 plus cot square theta okay so this is third identity cosec square theta is equal to 1 plus cot square theta okay 
सो हियर कोसेक स्क्वायर थीटा मीन्स कोसेक थीटा ब्रैकेट स्क्वायर ओके कॉट स्क्वायर अगेन सेम कॉट थीटा ब्रैकेट स्क्वायर फॉर ऑल वैल्यूज ऑफ ट्रिग्नोमेट्रिक रेशोज मीन्स साइन स्क्वायर कॉट स्क्वायर दैट इज इफ साइन स्क्वायर थीटा इज देयर साइन थीटा ब्रैकेट स्क्वायर ओके नाउ हियर for this three identities remark is there okay so what is remark that is if i am taking this identity sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 so we can change the values of or we can shift this values here suppose if i have to find values of sin square value of sin square theta so shift cos square theta is equal to uh, The cos square theta this side, so that is sine square theta is equal to one minus cos square theta. Similarly, if I have to find value of cos square theta, shift sine square theta to RHS, so one minus sine square theta. So this is first one. So we will get another three identities. Okay, second one. Uh, one plus tan square theta. Is equal to sec square theta. So here again same. One is equal to sec square theta minus tan square theta. Okay. So we will get this one identity, or we can shift one this side. So tan square theta is equal to sec square theta minus one. Okay. From this. Sec square theta minus tan square theta. This is a square minus b square. We can write sec theta minus tan theta, and into sec theta plus tan theta is equal to one. So this we can write one upon sec theta minus tan theta is equal to sec theta plus tan theta, or vice versa, one upon sec theta plus tan theta. Is equal to sec theta minus tan theta. Okay. Similarly, for this third one, this one cos x square theta plus uh, is equal to one plus cot square theta. So cot square theta minus cos x square theta is equal to one. So again same. This is cot theta minus cos x theta and cot theta. Plus cosec theta is equal to one. So if we shift this side, cot theta minus cosec theta value is one upon cot theta plus cosec theta, and similarly cot theta plus cosec theta that is a one upon cot theta minus cosec theta. Okay. Only keep in mind these three important identities. That is a sine square theta plus cos square theta is equal to one. Then one plus tan square theta is equal to uh, sec square theta, and this is first one. This is second and third one. One plus cot square theta is equal to cos x square theta. Okay. this two identities we can prove if we divide this first identity by cos square theta so here sin square by cos square tan square cos square by cos square 1 and 1 upon cos square sec square theta so we will get second identity if we divide this by sin square theta so we will get third identity so sin square theta by sin square theta 1 cos square theta by sin square theta that is a cos theta by sin theta is a cot theta so it is cot square theta and 1 upon sin square theta cos x square theta okay so there is this is another method to prove second and third identity okay now we will take examples based on these three identities okay first example is prove that the following trigonometric identities okay so here i am taking two sub questions okay first two sub questions 
so first one is 1 minus sin square theta into sec square theta is equal to 1 second one cos square theta into 1 plus tan square theta is equal to 1 so here i am writing these three identities first one sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 1 plus tan square theta is equal to sec square theta and 1 plus cot square theta is equal to cosec square theta okay now we will start from this first sub question so what is given here 1 minus sin square theta into sec square theta is equal to 1 so we take lhs that is a 1 minus sin square theta into sec square theta okay now see here from this first identity what is the value of 1 minus sin square theta if we shift this sin square theta this side then 1 minus sin square theta is equal to cos square theta okay so instead of this 1 minus sin square theta we have to put value is cos square theta so this value we have to shift as a uh, replace as a cos square theta so cos square theta into sec square theta since sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 okay so 1 minus sin square theta is equal to cos square theta so instead of this we have to replace as a cos square theta okay now cos square theta and sec square theta these are or cos and sec these are reciprocal of each other so this cos square theta we can write as a 1 upon sec square theta into this sec square theta as it is so this will get cancelled and we have answer is 1 so this is equal to rhs okay so only we have to put value of 1 minus sin square theta that is a cos square theta by using first trigonometric identity okay so this is cos square theta into sec square theta this cos square theta is a 1 upon sec square theta into sec square theta so this value we will get as a 1 then second one cos square theta into 1 plus tan square theta is equal to 1 so lhs first i am writing here cos square theta into 1 plus tan square theta so cos square theta keep as it is 1 plus tan square theta so this one we have directly value from second identity 1 plus tan square theta is equal to sec square theta so instead of this identity we have to substitute sec square theta okay since 1 plus tan square theta is equal to sec square theta again same cos theta and sec, sec theta are reciprocal of each other so cos theta we can replace as a 1 upon sec theta here cos square theta is there so only we have to write 1 upon sec square theta into this sec square theta as it is this will get cancelled value is a 1 that is a rhs okay so this type of example we will take more okay now i am taking next sub question that is a third sub question so here third sub question is okay i am rubbing this also and here i am taking fourth one so third one that is a cos square theta plus 1 upon 1 plus cot square theta is equal to 1 and second one that is a 1 upon 1 plus sin theta plus 1 upon 1 minus sin theta is equal to 2 sec square theta okay now we will take first this sub question okay again lhs that is a cos square theta plus 1 upon 1 plus cot square theta okay 
Now see this third identity, one plus cot square theta. That is a cosec square theta. So cos square theta plus one upon one plus cot square theta. That is a cosec square theta. So here we have to write reason one plus cot square theta is equal to cosec square theta. Okay. So cos square theta. Plus one upon cosec square theta. Now we know that sine theta and cosec theta are reciprocal of each other. So one upon cosec theta is a sine theta. So instead of one upon cosec square theta, here I am writing reason one upon cosec theta that is equal to sine theta. Okay. So one upon cosec square theta we can write it is as sine square theta. Okay. And cos square theta plus sine square theta. This value is a one by first identity. Okay. So since sine square theta plus cos square theta is equal to one. Okay. So this is a RHS. Okay. So this one are easy. Fourth one. Now here LHS is given one upon one plus sine theta. Plus one upon one minus sine theta. Okay, you can start from either LHS or RHS. Okay, here I am taking LHS. That is easy to solve. Okay, so one upon one plus sine theta. Now here, first make same denominator. So one minus sine theta. We have to cross multiply this one minus sine theta plus one plus sine theta divided by one plus sine theta. Into one minus sine theta. Okay. Now here minus sine theta plus sine theta will get cancelled. One plus one that is a two, and divided by one minus sine square theta. One plus sine theta, one minus sine theta. A plus b, a minus b. That is a a square minus b square. One square is one minus a b square is sine square. So one minus sine square theta. So two divided by One minus sine square theta, so again same. Sine square theta plus cos square theta is one. So one minus sine square theta, that is a cos square theta. So instead of this, we have to put value is a cos square theta. So reason is here. Sine square theta plus cos square theta is equal to one. Therefore, one minus sine square theta is equal to cos square theta. Okay. Now again, we want here two into sec square theta. So two is here. We want cos uh, sec square theta. So we know that one upon cos theta. That is a sec theta. So one upon cos square theta is there. That is a. Or we can write first like this way: two into one upon cos square theta. So this we can write two into sec square theta because one upon cos square is a sec square. So. One upon cos theta is equal to sec theta. So two sec square theta. Okay. So this is the RHS. Okay. So similarly, we solve more examples. Okay. And this is the important part in this lesson. Okay. We will take now second example. Example two is again same. Prove the following trigonometric identities. So In that first sub question is cot square theta minus one upon sine square theta is equal to minus one. We have to prove. So first we have to take LHS that is cot square theta minus one upon sine square theta. Okay. Now cot square theta we have to keep as it is minus one upon sine theta. We know that it is a cosec theta. So one upon sine square theta, we have to write as a cosec square theta. Since one upon sine theta is equal to cosec theta. Okay. Now cot square theta minus cosec square theta. So here, if we take this third identity, one plus cot square theta is equal to cosec square theta. So now here we want cot square theta minus cosec square theta. So if we 
shift this one this side we will get it is a minus 1 so cot square theta minus cos square theta is equal to minus 1 or this one we can write if we put value of cos square theta so cos square theta value is 1 plus cot square theta so cot square theta as it is minus in bracket cos square theta value is 1 plus cot square theta okay since 1 plus cot square theta is equal to cos square theta so cot square theta minus 1 and minus cot square theta so this cot square theta minus cot square theta will get cancelled so what is remain minus 1 that is a rhs okay so this is first one second one 1 plus tan square theta into 1 plus sin theta into 1 minus sin theta is equal to 1 we have to prove so 1 plus tan square theta first i am taking lhs that is a 1 plus tan square theta 1 plus sin theta into 1 minus sin theta okay now 1 plus tan square theta okay now here directly we put value 1 plus tan square theta by second identity it is a sec square theta so 1 plus tan square theta we have to put directly value is a sec square theta then 1 plus sin theta into 1 minus sin theta so a plus b a minus b that is a 1 minus sin square theta a square minus b square so a square that is a 1 square is 1 minus sin square theta so sec square theta into now here we have to write reason for second step that is 1 plus tan square theta is equal to sec square theta okay so sec square theta into a 1 minus sin square theta again first identity see here 1 minus sin square theta that is a cos square theta so value of 1 minus sin square that is a cos square okay since sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 so 1 minus sin square theta is equal to cos square theta so sec square theta into cos square theta now sec theta and cos theta are reciprocal of each other so sec square theta we can write 1 upon cos square theta into this cos square theta so this will get cancelled that is equal to 1 so here I am writing reason sec theta is equal to 1 upon cos theta okay so this is second one now I am taking another two so third one is third sub question that is uh, 1 plus cot square theta into 1 minus cos theta 1 plus cos theta is equal to 1 okay and sec, uh, fourth one that is fourth one is tan square theta minus 1 upon cos square theta is equal to minus 1 okay so how we simplify this LHS I am taking this 1 plus cot square theta 1 minus cos theta into 1 plus cos theta okay so 1 plus cot square theta that is uh, cos x square theta by using third identity directly we can write 1 plus cot square theta cos x square theta and a minus b a plus b 1 minus cos theta 1 plus cos theta that is a 1 square minus cos square so 1 square is 1 minus cos square theta so here 1 plus cot square theta reason is equal to cos x square theta now cos x square theta into 1 minus cos square theta by using first identity sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 if we want value of 1 minus cos square theta so 1 minus cos square is 
sin square. So instead of this 1 minus cos square, we have to substitute sin square theta. So cos x square theta into sin square theta. Now we know that cos x theta and sin theta are reciprocal of each other. So this cos x square theta, 1 upon sin square theta into sin square theta. So cos x theta is equal to 1 upon sin theta, reason. Now this will get cancelled. So we have value is a 1, okay. Then fourth one, tan square theta minus 1 upon cos square theta is equal to, we have to show that it is a minus 1. So I am writing first LHS tan square theta minus 1 upon cos square theta. So tan square theta minus 1 upon cos square theta that is a sec theta because cos theta and sec theta are reciprocal of each other. So 1 upon cos square theta that is a sec square theta since 1 upon cos theta is equal to sec theta okay. Now tan square theta minus value of sec square theta by using second identity that is a 1 plus tan square. So sec square theta we have to replace by 1 plus tan square theta. So tan square theta minus 1 minus tan square theta. This will get cancelled. So answer is a minus 1 that is a RHS. Okay. So this is fourth sub question. Now we will take more examples on this trigonometric identities. Next example is Prove the following trigonometric identities and first sub question is sin theta upon 1 minus cos theta is equal to cosec theta plus cot theta. Okay. So now we will start either from LHS or RHS. Okay. So here I am taking LHS that is a sin theta upon 1 minus cos theta. Okay. Now here I am multiplying numerator and denominator by 1 plus cos theta. Okay. Here I am multiplying numerator and denominator by 1 plus cos theta. Why I multiply here 1 plus cos theta? Because in denominator if we observe this 1 minus cos theta into 1 plus cos theta that is a 1 minus cos square theta and we know that 1 minus cos square theta is equal to sin square theta. So we can simplify further. So here sin theta into 1 plus cos theta divided by 1 minus cos theta into 1 plus cos theta that is a, a minus b a plus b. So a square that is a 1 square 1 minus cos square theta okay now sin theta into 1 plus cos theta divided by 1 minus cos square theta is equal to sin square theta because sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 so 1 minus cos square theta if we shift this cos square theta here 1 minus cos square theta is equal to sin square theta so 1 minus cos square theta replaced by sin square theta. Okay. Now one sign will be cancelled here. So what is remain? 1 plus cos theta divided by sin theta. Okay. Now I want here cosec theta plus cot theta. So if we separate the denominator for each term of numerator, so what we have 1 upon sin theta plus cos theta by sin theta. So 1 upon sin theta that is a cosec theta and cos theta plus sin theta that is a cot theta. So this is equal to RHS. So this is first one. Okay. Similarly second one tan theta plus sin theta upon tan theta minus sin theta is equal to sec theta plus 1 upon sec theta minus 1. Okay. Now here LHS tan theta plus sin theta upon tan theta minus sin theta okay now here no need to multiply by tan theta plus sin theta because if we observe that in denominator tan theta minus sin theta into tan theta plus sin theta we 
get that tan square minus sin square. So tan square minus sin square, we don't have any identity. So no need to multiply here. So this tan theta, we have to write in terms of sin and cos. So tan theta, how we write? Sin theta plus, sorry, sin theta upon cos theta plus this sin theta as it is divided by tan theta minus sin theta. So this tan theta again write sin theta by cos theta minus sin theta. Okay. Now next step if we take sin theta common from numerator and denominator. So what we have sin theta here remain 1 upon cos theta plus 1. So 1 upon cos theta plus 1 divided by if we take sin theta common from denominator then sin theta in bracket 1 upon cos theta minus 1 okay so this sin theta will get cancelled 1 upon cos theta that is a sec theta so sec theta plus 1 upon 1 upon cos theta that is sec theta and this minus 1 so we will get rhs sec theta plus 1 upon sec theta minus 1 okay now we will take third and fourth sub question of same question so third one is here okay so i am taking one one then third one that is cot theta minus tan theta is equal to 2 cos square theta minus 1 upon sin theta into cos theta okay now lhs is equal to cot theta minus tan theta okay so cot theta we can write cos theta upon sin theta minus tan theta we can write sin theta upon cos theta okay then make same denominator so multiply this so cos theta into cos theta that is a cos square theta minus sin theta into sin theta sin square theta divided by sin theta into cos theta now see this rhs denominator we have sin theta into cos theta okay only in numerator we want 2 cos square theta minus 1 so here value of sin square theta we can replace by 1 minus cos square theta okay so cos square theta minus value of sin square 1 minus cos square theta upon sin theta into cos theta because we know that sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 so sin square theta we can put 1 minus cos square theta okay now if we simplify this cos square theta minus 1 and minus minus plus cos square theta divided by sin theta into cos theta okay now cos square theta plus cos square theta 2 cos square theta minus 1 divided by sin theta into cos theta okay so this is rhs similarly fourth one that is a only tan theta minus cot theta so tan theta minus cot theta we have to prove that this tan theta minus cot theta is equal to 2 sin square theta minus 1 upon sin theta into cos theta okay so same procedure we have to do this lhs is equal to tan theta minus cot theta value of tan is sin theta upon cos theta minus value of cot is cos theta upon sin theta make same denominator so sin square theta minus cos square theta divided by sin theta into cos theta okay now here we want sin square theta 2 sin square theta so replace value of cos square theta so sin square theta minus 1 minus sin square theta divided by 
साइन थीटा इन टू कॉस थीटा ओके सो साइन स्क्वेर थीटा माइनस वन प्लस साइन स्क्वेर थीटा डिवाइडेड बाय साइन थीटा इन टू कॉस थीटा सो वी हैव टू साइन स्क्वेर थीटा माइनस वन अपॉन साइन थीटा इन टू कॉस थीटा ओके सो ना वी विल टेक नेक्स्ट एग्जाम्पल ओके दैट इज अ प्रूव द फॉलोइंग ट्रिग्नोमेट्रिक आइडेंटिटीज सो एग्जाम्पल फोर प्रूव द फॉलोइंग ट्रिग्नोमेट्रिक आइडेंटिटीज फर्स्ट वन इज ओके फर्स्ट वन इज स्क्वे रूट ऑफ वन प्लस साइन सॉरी वन माइनस साइन थीटा अपॉन वन प्लस साइन थीटा इज इक्वल टू सेक थीटा माइनस टेन थीटा ओके सो वी विल स्टार्ट फ्रॉम एल एच एस स्क्वे रूट ऑफ वन माइनस साइन थीटा अपॉन वन प्लस साइन थीटा ओके सो नाउ अगेन सेम वी हैव टू मल्टीप्लाय न्यूमरेटर एंड डिनोमिनेटर बाय वन माइनस साइन थीटा ओके बिकॉज इफ यू मल्टीप्लाय दिस वन माइनस साइन थीटा न्यूमरेटर विल कन्वर्ट इन कॉ स्क्वेर थीटा बिकॉज वन प्लस साइन थीटा इन टू वन माइनस साइन थीटा वन माइनस साइन स्क्वेर थीटा एंड वन माइनस साइन स्क्वेर थीटा दैट इज इक्वल टू कॉ स्क्वेर थीटा ओके सो हियर इन न्यूमरेटर वन माइनस साइन थीटा इन टू वन माइनस साइन थीटा दैट इज अ वन माइनस साइन थीटा ब्रैकेट स्क्वेर डिवाइडेड बाय वन प्लस साइन थीटा इन टू वन माइनस साइन थीटा दैट इज अ वन माइनस साइन स्क्वेर थीटा ओके सो वन माइनस साइन थीटा ब्रैकेट स्क्वेर डिवाइडेड बाय वन माइनस साइन स्क्वेर थीटा दैट इज अ कॉ स्क्वेर थीटा ओके सो इफ वी टेक स्क्वेर रूट ऑफ दिस स्क्वेर रूट ऑफ वन माइनस साइन थीटा स्क्वेर सो वी विल गेट वन माइनस साइन थीटा एंड डिवाइडेड बाय कॉ स्क्वेर थीटा इफ यू टेक स्क्वेर रूट दैट इज अ कॉस थीटा Now separate the denominator. So one upon cos theta minus sine theta by cos theta. So one upon cos theta is a sec theta, and sine theta by cos theta that is a tan theta. So sec theta minus tan theta that is RHS of this example. Okay. Similarly, we will solve second one. So second one is. square root of 1 plus cos theta upon 1 minus cos theta is equal to cosec theta plus cot theta okay so first lhs that is a 1 plus cos theta into 1 minus cos theta multiply by conjugate of this that is a 1 plus cos theta to numerator and denominator okay so numerator becomes 1 plus cos theta bracket square denominator is a minus b a plus b that is a square minus b square so 1 square minus cos square theta okay so square root of 1 plus cos theta bracket square divided by 1 minus cos square theta sin square theta by using first identity so here we have 1 plus cos theta bracket square upon sin square theta and square root of this so if we remove this square root we have 1 plus cos theta divided by sin theta if we separate this 1 upon sin theta plus cos theta by sin theta okay so 1 upon sin theta cosec theta plus cos theta by sin theta cot theta so this is equal to rhs okay